hey welcome to this basic video tutorial and in this video I'm going to talk about how to add dimensions to an image and how to make it and what transparency is so follow along if you're new to photo editing if you're not that familiar um, dimensions are like the size of the picture so if you're gonna put a picture this is especially important if you're putting up something on YouTube and you want to make the right dimensions for a thumbnail or for channel art or if you want something to, to show really well on um, a website you have to find the right dimensions in order for that to fit into the website so we'll go ahead and click create new image and this video all we're talking about is the things that are right here in the center so we have this thing called presets presets are if you want to do like a 1980 by or 1920 by 1080 it's like a 1080p picture maybe you want like a 780p picture that's all the size so that's dimension so that's width and length length times width <clears throat> they already have a whole bunch of presets here in pixlr which can save you a lot of time then you're not having to you know think about what your custom presets are you can go ahead and just use one of the ones below they have a lot of different options here so, I mean, look, you can also, it is customizable in the sense that it'll start right at 1920 by 1080, but maybe you want the width to be just a little longer to fit the screen that you're, that you're shooting on. You can also give it a name. Right now the name is untitled. And lastly, transparency. So transparency means if you want the image to have nothing behind it. So, for example, let's say you had a logo and... The logo is like a smiley face, but let me see if I can actually give you an example of transparency. So if I didn't click transparent, this is what it would be. I'd have a white background. But if I click transparent, so let's say I created a new image, one that was transparent, I'd have this checkered background, which means that everything is invisible. However, with this one, like if I added an image to it, you're still going to have that white background. I hope this dimensions and transparency video helps. You know, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment box below. Otherwise, I'm signing out and I'll see you guys next time.